Okay, this video is best musicals of all time, and basically by far my favorite uh, are Les Miserables. You know, I went to that original show in 1985, uh, 1987. Uh, this is the best version. There's a whole bunch of versions of the music, but this CD, the 1987 original cast, it's the best. The first CD, it's so great. I listen to it all the time when I'm exercising. If I'm going for a personal best record, I'll listen to something else, a little more high energy, but the entire first disc from start to finish is great. The second disc is not so great, but of course there's a movie. You know, the, the musical Les Mis is okay. The movies of Les Mis are great. The book is great. It's like probably the second best novel ever written. Um, Amadeus was my favorite movie. The movie itself, I loved Amadeus. I thought that was a great portrayal of a genius. Um... The CD is great as well. So those are the, they're full of good songs. I can't even just name one because there's so many good songs on both of these. Um, the whole thing about Jean Valjean and Javert and the Bishop Forgives Him and Les Mis, it's, it's fantastic. It's great. Everyone should know Les Mis. You know, you got kids, you want to educate them. And a lot of times too, I'll make these videos because a lot of young people, they don't have any cultural experience practically at all. Um, and older people, you know, we love to look back and remember this stuff. Okay, multiple good songs. You know, the sound of music. I just love the sound of music. Yeah, you can say it's corny or childish or something, but I loved it. Okay, um, I saw it a bunch of times. Okay, one hit wonders. There's a whole bunch of one hit wonders from musicals and related type shows. Um, you know, Ah Sweet Mystery of Life, one of the greatest love songs ever with Nelson Eddy and Jenna McDonald. My father used to love listening to all that stuff. Okay, Memory by Cats. I went with my girlfriend to the musical Cats, and I thought the musical itself was kind of silly, but I love this particular song, and I just sort of remember the time. Oh, What a Beautiful Morning, Oklahoma, great. Somewhere Over the Rainbow, Judy Garland, great. Impossible Dream, I like that and sort of the theme of it. You know, what's the best version? The Brian Stokes Mitchell version of the original soundtrack is pretty good. You might find a better one, but that's pretty good. Oh, Mio Babino Caro from the opera. I just love that song. Maria Callas, you know, like he's talking to his daughter and she's, you know, arguing with her dad about what she wants and what she's going to do. It's funny. Um, Un bel di vedremo. Someday my ship will come in. He'll come back to me. Madam Butterfly, Maria Callas. Fantastic version of that. Uh, Phantom of the Opera. You know, the opera itself, I went and saw that one too with my girlfriend. It was okay. Um, Les Mis was the best of the ones I went and saw with my girlfriend. But... All I Ask of You, I was my favorite song from that. Um, Autumn Leaves, Edith Piaf, even though it's not necessarily an opera or a musical, it's often used in movies and stuff, and I just love the Edith Piaf. Um, also her Mon Dieu song, I mean, you know, how beautiful, the voice of a sparrow, the French language. Okay, Summertime from Porgy and Bess. There's a lot of singers that have a good version of that. Old Man River, Paul Robeson. And I know there's lots of good stuff that I didn't include here. I just sort of included all the stuff I could remember and that I quickly could find on the Internet. I uh, hope you found this enjoyable. If you think there's other great stuff I should have included, please put it in the comments.